Head coach Chris Panos is no stranger to the Queens men's lacrosse program. After serving as an assistant for two seasons in 2019, unexpectedly, it's his turn to take the lead. Athletic director Sherry Swarthout called me in and wanted to speak to me more about the opportunity and, and just sort of the, my experiences with the program, with the players, the recruiting, sort of what I helped Coach Kivlin build um, seemed like the natural fit. Um, but certainly uh, the challenge that lied ahead, uh, I felt like I could fulfill with confidence. Chris Kivlin was named head coach in May of 2016 and in his first year led Queens to a number 18 final ranking and a trip to the South Atlantic Conference Championship game. But at the end of year two, Kivlin chose to step down. Yeah, we had just gone out for a weekly, our weekly lunch. It was just sort of normal uh, back to business. And, uh, you know, he informed me that he was going to be stepping away for health reasons and family personal reasons. So we, we, we sort of, it sort of caught me off guard. Um, but then again, it was sort of, for me, it was an opportunity uh, to kind of fulfill one of my ultimate goals, which is to be a head coach. In the 2018 season, Panos led the sidelines as an acting head coach in three games. The Royals went 3-0, including an upset of defending national champion and then seventh-ranked Limestone College. For the first time in 12 years, Queens defeats Limestone. One of those games where I felt, you know, let's just go out and have fun and, and, and just play your best and play instinctive lacrosse and, and just be fierce competitors. And, you know, that's sort of a landmark uh, victory for me and the program, certainly, where we can say, hey, we can play with the best teams in, in the South region. Panos's goal is to develop young men on and off the field. In the fall, the team partook in several community service endeavors, including the American Heart Association's Heart Walk, Dog Tag Dash, Walk to the Poles, and Team Impact. For, for me and for the guys, it shows us that it's about more than just the cross. Um, you know, we're here for four years, but we want to learn to be a better person. That's the biggest thing. And Coach Panos really emphasizes that, too, is, yeah, you're on this team, but you're learning to be, like, you're learning for your career. You're learning to be a better man. Queens opened its season last weekend with a 16-2 victory over Montreat College. The Royals will be right here on Saturday for their home opener versus North Greenville. For the Queen Sports Network, I'm Julia Osbrook.